this is a 100 watt portable solar panel system from All Like. Um, but what's neat about this is this is kind of this accordion style. This is the only amount of space that it takes up. So you have 100 watts of solar in a spot that could fit, you know, in a side panel of a car. But what's neat about it is you can actually open it up. It's magnetic closure. You open it up and now you've got a hundred watts of complete solar here and you can angle it towards the sun. This you can point towards the sun and you can get the angle. So it's not the amount of solar as much as the angle to the sun. So the way I'm able to do that so easily is these built-in feet. So it's got these built-in feet so you can collapse it up like I showed like that. You can bring it all the way out and when you get it flat that's when you kick the feet out but let's take a look here. I'm gonna show you what's in this bag because that's the other cool part about it. So this bag has your connectors here. Now, what's neat about this one is if you have an RV and you want to plug your RV in, it has standardized MC4 connectors. Beauty about MC4 connectors when you're dealing with power and solar and all that stuff, these are all standard now. So you got a positive and a negative, the red being the positive towards the generator. Um, but it does come with another Let's do our quick table uh, cable test here. It looks like another six, more than six feet of cable, plus whatever your loop is here. We'll go check, take a look. So very easy again to hook up. Go ahead and plug this one there, plug this one there. And now I've got at least 12, maybe 15 feet of cable to plug in to my solar generator outside or inside or wherever it's at. Now you can do a, a traditional AC input, but this is they're gonna be their solar charging plug. So it'll plug in just like that, and it's gonna charge this up while it's in use. So you can actually turn this unit on. This is a very sturdy panel option. So with these two combined, you literally have a thousand watts, which will run multiple computers, and the ability to get up to 100 watts to recharge them. So that's what this is, is their 100 watt recharging panel. So this is the quick start guide. It shows you everything about it. There's also going to be this technical spec label, and that's what you wanna see on any solar, this one has an efficiency of 22.8%. That's really, really high. So like I said, you can get cheaper solar panels and you can get uh, hard panels, you know, when you actually are trying to take them with you, they take up way too much room. This compact folding design is really awesome. This is gonna work negative four to 149 degrees. The maximum current is gonna be at 20.8 volts and it's gonna go uh, 4.8 amps. Now what's neat about this is you could use this with another person's charge controller if it, it manages to run these specs, which is pretty normal here. Uh, but additionally, you don't need a solar charge controller if you plug it into the All Like or any other brand that has a solar uh, capable input. Uh, it is waterproof, 100 and, uh, sorry, IP68, uh, water and dust proof, that's what it is. And it is a monocrystalline uh, solar panel with MC4 connectors, as I mentioned earlier. If this was mounted flat on a van roof or anything, it would not be bringing anything up. Now you can mount this, it does have grommets, so you could hang it or mount it or do some other thing, but the cool thing about it is the portability of it. So as you can see, this is my car. I actually have it on the hood of my car there, so you can uh, see it going around. Um, I'm just taking a quick look at it. I put it up on the windshield. Depending on the angle of the sun, you could lay it flat on the windshield. You could lay it flat on the top of your car. In my case, the sun was kind of low on the horizon being the winter in the northwest. You can see where it is way over there. So I just kicked the feet out, threw it up on my hood, and I'm literally charging, and I topped off my solar generator to 100%, like almost instantly. It didn't take long at all. And uh, that's what I was just showing you, is I just run those connectors down and plug it into the back of this unit and now you're charging completely off grid, which is pretty sick. So I like that. Now it doesn't have to be on a vehicle. If you're gonna go camping, you just wanna leave this on a picnic table or something. You can see I'm at 100% there. Very easy to open, to stow, to do all that stuff. Here, hopefully I'm gonna come up in a second <laughs> and I'll just show you how you can uh, collapse it. It's a little tricky to try to put it on a, a long hood like that, but it actually worked again. You don't have to be moving this all the time, but it is gonna outperform a fixed solar panel that was flat on a roof by five fold easily. Pretty easy, and you can angle it with those back connectors. You see how easy that is. Um, but this is from the All Like Company. If it does get the maximum of a 100 watt solar, which is pretty rare to actually get the maximum on these, you'll get about 80% pretty routinely 
in full sun, maybe 90% efficiency out of this, uh, the rating. So you'll, you can count on 90 watts. Then you can divide that out. You know, you may uh, be able to charge a thousand watt unit because this one will get all the way down to the bottom to zero. Um, it doesn't have any memory or anything like that. It'll take you 12 hours of sun to fill it up completely. But the neat thing about having a hundred watts is it's a whole lot better than like a Jackery 60 watt, which I've shown you before. Very similar panel size, uh, actually. And this will work with other manufacturers, uh, solar generators. You just have to have the MC4 to whatever connector or that orange connector style. And again, 23% overall efficiency of the panel, which is a great efficiency rating. So it's that newer style panel. Uh, with those MC4 connectors, you can go right into a solar ready RV. So if you have one of those, this could be your kind of, that is from the All Like Company. I want to thank them for sending that out for a fair and honest review.